There were 48 more boys than girls at the party. Another 10 boys and 10 girls joined the party. After that, there were four times as many boys as girls. How many boys were there at the party initially? Now, there were 48 more boys than girls at the party. As you can see, we are comparing the number of boys to the girls. And so we draw a comparison model, boys and girls, and there are more boys. So therefore, I draw a longer unit for the boys and a shorter unit for the girl. And 48 more boys, that is to say, the difference would be 48. 48 more boys than girls. Another 10 boys and 10 girls join the party. So we have 10 boys and 10 girls join the party. Now if you were to notice, 10 boys and 10 girls, it is equal number of girls and equal number of boys that join the party. That means to say, if 10 boys join the boys and 10 girls join the girls, that will make our difference remain the same. And that is why this is a constant difference question because the difference, the difference between the boys and girls remain the same. Alright, so I'm going to draw 10 boys join the boys and 10 girls join the girl. If I were to draw the 10 at the end of this model and another 10 girls at this model, it can make the model a bit messy. Instead, I will draw it right in front since it's the same number of boys and girls that join the boys and girls. So since 10 boys join the party and 10 girls join the party I can do it this way can you see that it makes the whole model drawing quite neat <clears throat> all right so after 10 boys join the party and 10 girls join the party what actually happens after that there were four times as many boys as girls so now we know that if girl is one unit the boys will be four times so the boys will be four units four times as many boys as girls okay so we want to now write our equation so let's see if this is one unit here will be four unit minus away one unit that will give us three unit so you can see three unit plus one unit that will give us four units here okay so 3 units is the same as 48, so let's find 1 unit, will be 48 divided by 3, okay, let's do our working here, 48 divided by 3, Sixteen. so it equal to 16, so my 1 unit is 16, now we want to find the number of boys at the end first so number of boys at the end will be 4 unit so 4 unit is the same as 4 times 16 so 16 times 4 64 equal to 64 and then I want to find the number of boys initially which means that boys at first, all right? The word initially means the boys at first. So that means to say the number of boys at the end take away the 10 boys that join the party. So that will give us 54. So that means to say 54 boys were at the party initially. So answer is 54 boys. Thank you.